Welcome back to an episode of Bass Bros. And today, guys, we're starting off this video in the evening of the charter trip. And I'm heading out on the beach right now, as you can see the beach behind me. I'm doing some surf casts and hopefully catch some more catfish because that's apparently the owl that bites. But I'm actually going for literally anything that bites. So if anything wants my bait, I would be very happy if it took it. And also for this video, guys, we're going to do a catch and cook on those mackerel that we caught in the charter because we got to keep like four of them, the ones that we didn't use for shark bait. So hopefully that will taste good and you guys just stay tuned. That's a sail. Huh? That's a sail catfish. So Danny just caught one here. He made a bet for five dollars. You owe me five dollars. Right? You said we weren't gonna catch anything, so. Fair enough. Now that's not a hard head, that's a sail. I'm gonna point that out because I know it's true. See, you really Because you can see it's sails right there. I looked it up. It's big old fins. See, we're gonna say it, but we're not gonna like. Yeah, I'm gonna say it, but I'm gonna be wrong like I was in the last video, or the last two, vi two videos ago. I was completely wrong with everything I named. But yeah, I'm, I'm almost positive. Well, he almost got one. Yeah, you, you know, I can't lift can't lip them. Sorry, people were making fun of it. You know, I'm gonna do it anyways. Yeah, like, I don't really care. But yeah, nice, nice little, little catfish. catfish That's definitely a sale, as you can tell. As you can tell. Please let wrong. me know if I'm right or wrong in the comments, but don't be rude. But yeah, nice little looking catfish right there. You fine? Rip. I think I still have them. Maybe. Yep. Another whiting. Nice whiting. These are whiting, not redfish, as we've been corrected. It would make sense because it's white, not red, but you know. We're gonna let him go because he obviously does not like me. What? Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh. All right, there he goes. <laughs> there we go, folks. Got another one here. It's probably another whiting because it's not fighting at all. But you can still feel the weight of them, so you know you have one. They're just really small, but it's still a lot of fun to catch them. There we go. Tiny catfish. Well, I mean, I'll take the catfish, but I know a lot of people don't like catching them. There he is. Well, folks, uh, another catfish. Time to let me go. Yeah. There it is. Got another one. Feels a little bit better. Probably a catfish because they fight a little bit harder than whiting. Actually, no, it stopped fighting, but it's probably like stuck in the current. Or it got off. Yeah, they got off. Really now. Yep, there's one, there's one. <sighs> like instantly, as soon as I like hit the water, he just came up and snatched it. Yep, oh yeah. Pretty decent one. Probably not, but you know, I just like to get my hopes up. I mean, yeah, another catfish, as expected. He just gobbled that shrimp like instantly. Come here, mate. Oh, another catfish there. Time to let him go. See you later, bud. Whew. Oh. And he's hooked. Yep. Definitely just another catfish, because that's all we catch in the ocean. That's okay. At least it's something, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, they do put up a decent fight, so not, not going to complain at all. Just like to catch new species. And all we're catching is catfish. Nice old catfish. Really now, really bud, do you want to stop? Oh, as you can see, another catfish. He gave you a kiss. Now we're gonna let him go. Down he goes. It's too small to know if we still have it. I mean, just keep reeling, you'll feel some weight if he's there. Also, we'll see him here shortly. 
Yeah, I got him. Still got him? Catfish. Catfish? Pretty normal. No. Yeah, there he is. Another catfish. What do you have to say about these catfish? Well, I mean, they were fun now. Now they're just like getting kind of irritating. Yeah. At least we're catching something though. There you go. This little hard head catfish right there. I think I might be getting one. Yep, there's one. Yep, it's definitely a little guy. Or he's just getting sucked in the current, which would also be, he's little because he can't fight it. But yeah, I definitely have one though. Yes, sir. What is it? Uh, another catfish, of course. What do you expect? Another catfish? Really, you're gonna do that? That's okay, you got it. I mean, I was gonna help you, but I guess you can figure it out. There he goes. I'll just reel it in anyways. If I got one, I got one. If not, well, we're gonna call it a night, and I definitely don't have one. But as you can tell, the sun is now basically set, and we're gonna go home and cook some mackerel. So catch you guys in the kitchen. Well, guys, now we're back in the house here, in the kitchen, got the pan, got the mackerel, and we're gonna just cook it up with some butter, salt, and pepper, because that's literally all we have here. It's a rental house, so obviously we don't have a lot of seasonings. We're not gonna go buy a bunch of junk, because that'd be a waste of money. Well, we're only gonna cook up a little bit of it, because the, the, the charter guy told us that there's like um, a restaurant where they can cook it up for us. So if we cook it and it tastes like garbage, then we might go over there and have actual people that know what they're doing cook it for us. Oh. Got the salt and pepper, and we're just gonna sprinkle it on here. Now we just throw a chunk of butter on the pan. A chunk of butter. It looks good to me, so we're just gonna take it off. I can get it off. Ooh, that's falling apart. Nice and flaky, because I'm just that good of a cook. Always turn it off when you're done, and now we're gonna let it cool off and give it a taste. And, um. It doesn't taste like anything. It doesn't taste like anything. I, I really don't like the texture, though. But yeah, I really can't taste anything. I mean,. Like I taste the pepper. That is literally like no pepper on it and that's what I taste. This was Spanish mackerel by the way. I think I just kept calling it mackerel so I wanted to specify the right species. It is, I mean it's edible. It's good. That's like, I'll eat it cause it don't taste like anything. Not fishy at all though, so that's good. I feel like we just need more of like, more seasoning, more seasoning or sauce or something to go with it. I mean I guess that goes for anything. There we go. I guess we'll eat the rest of these little pieces and catch you guys in the morning maybe if we go fishing. I don't really know because obviously I don't want to bore you guys with catching a bunch of catfish because that's all we catch. So I might go try the spot we did on day one where I caught the jack. Well folks, it is now the next morning here. I'm back at the first spot here. It's a lot calmer over here because like, it's, like, um, it's like a point that like the wind's blowing from that way, so it's really calm on this side, so that's nice. I'm gonna do a little, some casting with that same jig that I used to catch that jack in the first episode. And then maybe I'll send out like a piece of mullet and just see what happens there, because I don't really have much shrimp left, so I might have to use all the mullet I have. Although I'll get some more shrimp today, but you guys just stay tuned, hopefully I can catch some. Yo, what the heck is that? See that thing just like zooming? Yo, I don't know what that is. I'm not gonna touch it though, cause I don't wanna like, die. Yo, dude, you wanna get away from me? That's a big dude. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Well, that was like the biggest bite we've seen, but it doesn't feel any bigger. So I'm like over your line. Oh my gosh, 
Yeah, it's big, dude. No, I'm good. Okay. Dude, that's peeling drag, dude. What the heck? No, you're good. Just record. Yeah, yeah. Dude. What the heck is this? Just peel and drag. Oh, it's a, it's a shark. I, 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 I tell you, dude. Yeah, that's a shark, dude. 100%. Don't pull your line up, up, up. It's right here. It's good, just leave it, just leave it, just leave it. Just gotta get him up on shore. Dude, I just got a shark. Yes, sir. Oh my gosh. Gotta get him out of the current. Yep. There we go. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I don't know what type of shark that is, because I'm from Michigan, so not too sure, but that's pretty dope. Just got a shark from the surf, no way. This is really unexpected, but really dope catch. Put up a great fight. Let's go. All right, one last look at this absolute beauty. Look at that. Oh, that's so sick. No way. I was losing all hope this morning, and this guy just absolutely hammered my bait. So let's go. Well guys, it is now the night time, and we haven't picked up this camera since the morning when I caught that shark. So now we're back out at the beach, we're doing some fishing again at night. We got some more bait because we ran out, and now right now we're going to use shrimp because the mole is like completely frozen and we can't cut it up when it's completely frozen. So we're going to use that tomorrow and maybe the next day, I don't really know. We're going to try to catch one last fish here while the sun's setting, so you guys just stay tuned. Yeah, that's it. Oh my gosh. That's enough. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's another big one. Oh, he just popped off. Really now. Oh, but maybe he didn't. I don't even know. Oh, no, he didn't. He's just running towards me. Really? Nah, it's a ladyfish. That's shark bait is what that is. Really? Really? You're going to do that? All right, nope. All right, another new species here. It's a ladyfish. We caught it on the charter, but for us on the surf, that's a new species. Dope little catch there. Probably, oh, this side's not covered in sand, but nice fish. That's what we use to catch our shark, so that's pretty cool. But we're gonna let this one go, not use it as shark bait. And off he goes, or she goes, it's a ladyfish. Can't... It's walking, he wants to say hi to you, can he? I didn't know him. All right. You got it. Feel bigger? Yeah, it feels like catfish. But catfish. Main pull or not? Pull it. I mean, it's like they start, they get stuck in the current and it feels like you lost them. Oh, I can't. And then my the drag. You gotta stop reeling then. Yeah, no, I just, I mean, I just. Oh, oh. Maybe you should have kept that drag loose. Yeah, you right. Wait. What is that? I don't know. So walk it back, walk it back. Dang. Oh my gosh. Dad, loosen that. That's something big, dude. What is it? Oh, it's a... Uh... 
that that looks like a pompano. I'm not gonna say it is or not, but that's a new species for sure. Oh, I don't know what that is. No idea what that is, guys. If you know, let me know in the comments down below. Boom! How do you feel? You finally caught one today. Fine. Yeah, finally. No. Oh, hey. Really now? <laughs> All right. Hey, my bad. Hey, that's my fault. Would you call me? Yeah, it's not me. <laughs> Can't hold them, can you? Just let them. I got him. I got him. Okay. <laughs> okay now. You can't hold. Them. Just let them. I got that. Dude. Yep. There's one. He's on. He's on, boys. Doesn't feel that big, but. Huh? I don't think so. I don't know what it is. Might be another catfish. Let's see. Eh, catfish. Well, folks, another catfish. First one of the day, actually. So I'll take it. All right. Well, time to let him go. Just a little stinker, boy. And peace. Rip, you guys probably can't see anything. Catfish? Yeah. Is it sailing? No. That's another hardhead. You guys, the lighting's so bad, you can't see it. So I'm just gonna stop filming and we're probably gonna head in anyways. Well guys, this is where I'm going to end today's video there. So I hope you enjoyed that little catch and cook and that unexpected shark catch because I honestly did not expect to catch a shark from the shore, but that was a really cool and fun experience to be able to do that by myself, not on a charter, just to go out there by myself with my own baits, my own rods, some random collapsible rod with some 20 pound mono catching a shark. That's just pretty cool for me, at least being a Michigander, going out on the surf, catching some shark. That is pretty dope, not some shark, one shark. Anyways, guys, this is going to be the second to last episode. Next episode will be the last episode of the Flores Florida series. So I hope you re guys really enjoyed these series, and hopefully we can do more in the near future. Probably not, but like, you know, hopefully we'll be able to do some more traveling, but I don't really expect to. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a fat thumbs up. And as always, stay tuned. Till next time on Bass Bros. Oh, I finally got one, dude. No way. Oh yeah, I got him. I got him hooked.